Hello, and welcome to a one-plan demonstration of publishing Microsoft Project to OnePlan for a simplified project portfolio management solution. To start off the demonstration, I'm going to create a new plan in OnePlan. First, I need to pick the plan type and then enter a plan name. Once the plan has been created, I will need to fill out the plan's details. Next, I'm going to click on the Schedule tab and go to the Grid view. Once in the Grid view, I am now going to open Microsoft Project. Once Microsoft Project is open, I can either create a new project plan from scratch, or I can use a template. For this demonstration, I'm going to use an out-of-the-box template called Software Development. Now we have a completed Microsoft Project Plan based on a template. In this project plan, I can see we have some local resources assigned. The first thing I will need to do is connect Microsoft Project to OnePlan. In the OnePlan menu, I am going to click Connect, and then connect to my OnePlan group. Now that Microsoft Project is connected to my OnePlan group, I can now simply click the Publish button. The first step in publishing your Microsoft Project plan is to map your local resources to the OnePlan resources. This dialog box allows you to map those resources. OnePlan also supports generic resources like roles, vendors, and teams, so you can map those as well. Let's go ahead and map a few resources. Once we are done mapping our resources, I will click Save, and that will allow us to save our plan to a local or a SharePoint drive. Once the file is saved, OnePlan will ask if I want to create a new plan or connect to an existing plan in OnePlan. For this demonstration, I'm going to connect to the software development plan I created earlier. Now the project is publishing. Let's go ahead and go back to one plan and refresh the work planner. And now I can see my Microsoft Project schedule in one plan. I can expand the WBS tree structure by clicking on the arrows. I can add a Gantt to my view. I can change the grid view to see different data columns about the plan. For example, I can change the view to a cost view. I might also want to look at resource assignments for this project. I can simply click on the Scheduler tab, and it will load in the resources on this project and the tasks they have been assigned to. I can also change the zoom to drill in and out on date ranges. By clicking All Work, I can view resource assignments for all the plans in one plan. By bringing in the assignments from all the other plans in one plan, I can now see the resource's true availability. One plan also provides an online board to allow managers to work with team members and status upcoming work using a more visual Kanban board. OnePlan has the ability to combine scheduled tasks and a board of activities for true hybrid project management. 
I simply select a task and enter a list of activities that need to get done within the task. After I create my activities, I can simply status them by dragging and dropping them in the correct status. In one plan, you can post comments on a task by simply clicking on the chat icon. Once I click Enter, the comment will be posted and an email will be sent to team members assigned to the tasks as well as plan owners. If I was using one plan to manage resource capacity for portfolio selection and capacity planning, click on Resource Plans to view the capacity plan. Now I can either add resources manually or you can click the Import button to populate the Resource Capacity Plan from the schedule. If I'm using one plan for financial management, I can also import my Microsoft Project Plan labor cost into my financial plan. Click on the Financial tab and click Import. Once I have imported my role-based financials from Microsoft Project, I can now manually enter non-labor cost. Now let's go back to the portfolio plan and look at my new Microsoft project that I just published. In the portfolio plan, I can group my plans. For example, let's group these plans by portfolios. I can also look at different portfolio views. For example, let's take a look at the financial summary. Now that my Microsoft Project Plan has been published to one plan, team members can log into My Work and view a list of tasks that I have assigned to them. Team members can also update task status. For example, let's update the Determine Project Scope and Secure Project Sponsorship tasks that I just published. When these tasks are updated, I will get notified that there have been updates made, and then I can open my Microsoft Project Plan and click Updates. I can easily review the changes, and by double-clicking on the task, I can see the details on what has changed. Once I have reviewed the updates, I can accept the changes and apply them to my Microsoft Project Plan. Once I have updated my Microsoft Project Plan with the changes, I can publish out the updated Microsoft Project Plan to one plan. Thank you for participating in this quick introduction into publishing Microsoft Project to OnePlan for a simplified project portfolio management solution.